Hi Scorpio, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your April read. Let's see what message wants to show through for you today Scorpio. And of course these are general collective readings, will not resonate with all of you. Take what works for you, okay? Leave the rest. So let's begin. My angel spirit guides, please bless this reading for Scorpio and send them the messages they need to hear the most for the month of April. Thank you. All right, let's begin your reading. Welcome back all my subscribers. Thank you. Thank you for being here. And Scorpio, if you're new here, we welcome you as well. Do join us, subscribe to the channel, become part of us. We welcome you in. Wow, Scorpio, heading straight for the Ten of Cups. This is your April card, April energy. Well, I haven't finished uh, putting all the cards down. Let's see what's going to happen. Okay. And secret message from the universe. Scorpio, uh, Knight of Wands. Well, something exciting is coming in Scorpio, which is going to lead you to a lot of emotional happiness, it seems. This is like a fun energy, explorer energy, maybe travel energy, uh, something which is going to, and maybe, maybe if not alone, this could be with family or friends, giving you a lot of emotional happiness coming up. But right now, there, you may be experiencing a sudden change or this is some certain that news that's coming this is in your current energy i don't know what what this is now of course i'm going to clarify these cards scorpio and figure out uh, you didn't see this coming did you you did not see this coming your eyes were shut and you had these swords on your chest you did not want to see or you didn't see something coming but like it or not scorpio it's coming in Okay, and it's leading you to a lot of emotional happiness. So before I start clarifying these cards, Scorpio, let's start with a Ganesha Oracle card for you. Let's see what Lord Ganesha has for my Scorpio gang. So Lord Ganesha, for the month of April, for Scorpio, please give them a message. Understanding. Oh, I got two cards. Now I'm going to put them back, Scorpio. I just want to concentrate on one. Okay, so I'm going to put both these back and the other one was uh, enlightenment, okay. <laughs> yeah, enlightenment is coming with that towered energy that I saw. But I'm going to shuffle it again and uh, request Lord Ganesha to just give us one, one card for Scorpio. For the month of April. Okay, embrace embrace is your card and I have I've read read up on this card it's a beautiful message I'm going to read it out to you I'm going to read it out to you one second uh, what number is it spirit uh, number 11 okay number 11 which is number 11 is 29 that's also at 11 so you have an 11 11 already uh, 29 okay embrace Believe in yourself and others to discover a deeper, uh, deeper importance to your being. Recognize that your interaction with others are important. Healthy relationships, healthy relationships, which you're heading straight towards, require a lot of work to maintain them. In many parts of the world, hugging is recognized as a familiar kind of greeting. In addition to being a manner of acknowledgement or support or reassurance for someone else. Ganesha is encouraging you to maintain a compassionate heart. Be nurturing towards yourself and others. There will be a lot good that can be gained from seeing things from a practical or down-to-earth perspective when it comes to dealing with others or pertaining to your present circumstance. Focus on creating a balanced life for yourself. Remember that the more can be accomplished when you are serene. Be imaginative and helpful. Deal with issues as they arise. Keep your wits about you while you determine the best course of action and seek simple solutions to fix the problems with minimal fuss. Depending on the relationship of the people involved, a hug can symbolize familiarity, love, affection and friendship. A person may hug another to show support, comfort or to console. There is an exchange of energy that takes place as you give and receive at the same time. Okay, so maybe in the past, uh, Cancer, you were a little standoffish and you were a little, little hard and you didn't let anyone come very close to you. Um, 
you know that fear of uh, intimacy or fear of uh, just touch maybe well maybe there's a deep understanding that's going to come to you or is coming to you that hey you do need people in your life right so what lord ganesha is trying to say that uh, don't fear uh, don't fear love it's coming it's there for you you just take those blindfolds off and remove those swords and everything from you know in front of your chest that you've got maybe you've had them for a very long time a sudden change of perspective maybe is coming to you which is going to lead you into this youthful energy of interacting with others celebration joy and a feeling of love okay so before i continue talking let's take an angel blessing card as well So my angels, where are you? Where are you? Where, where are you? Where's, where's my angel deck? Oh, here it is. Okay. So, what do you have for my Scorpio gang for the month of April, my angels? For Scorpio, please. You found it. You found maybe the missing part of your happiness. maybe you find you are going to be finding it when you s- put down your guard and allow warmth to come into your life well things are going to change drastically in your life scorpio so allow that change to happen okay so that's the true meaning of life i mean if you find love that you have found it <laughs> that's all i can say so spirit what is this tower all about in the scorpio's current energy what is this sudden change that they're feeling this could be a change of mind could be a change of in your emotions could be a realization yeah yeah okay okay one more yeah you see you probably kept yourself very isolated till now scorpio you've been in isolation you've been uh, escaping maybe interacting with people or uh, allowing uh, loving relationships maybe in your life there is a certain change coming uh, all that uh, this hermit energy you're going to be escaping from no more no more of sitting in hermit mode there is uh, going to be that feeling that hey i do i do want to maybe socialize i do want to travel i want to meet new people i want to spend more time with my friends and family this could be a sudden realization within yourself that you're coming to and yes you will want when that this shake up happens scorpio when you realize you don't want to be you want to escape this hermit mode that you've put yourself in okay so what happens with it in the recent past why was uh, the two of swords here what happened in the recent past the king of wands king of wands is usually a character who likes um, i don't know they they are little they keep themselves to themselves it's about what makes them happy when they want want things uh, maybe you were in that uh, place where you felt that having other people in your life was like too troublesome and you didn't want the stress of maybe just having other people involved in your life maybe yeah there was there was a lack of love right either you were not allowing it uh, uh, scorpio and maybe that's why you were feeling that things are stagnant you were not able to move forward there was no excitement in life well you are escaping that from what i feel at least you want to from i'm seeing a change of mind happening here more than anything else So it's leading you straight to the ten of cups. What's coming in, uh, spirit? Whatever happened, happened in the past. Show us what's going to happen in April. What can uh, Scorpio expect? Ten of cups. I think uh, you're going to be having some communication. Yeah, you'll be you're planning to have some kind of communication with people who you've had some. breakups with or you some past bad memories have been created which have burdened you which you still kind of think about and it kind of overwhelms you i have a feeling there's some yeah something that i think which emotionally troubles you till date i don't know what that is there's certain things which still emotionally keep you overwhelmed or you know have been keeping you stuck or i think you 
this could be with children could be with family could be with soulmates i don't know some some bad memories uh, which have burdened you and uh, now as much as you never maybe wanted to talk about it about whatever disruption this was i think in the month of april you will be cle- like clearing the slate is that how you say it uh, and um, well it's going to lead you to happiness once again communication is the key to any problems in any kind of relationship i feel uh, scorpio something that's been on your mind something that's been he- weighing heavily on you some past unrest that was created with loved ones i think uh, april will clear that energy out it's going to be it's like a tower it has to happen you cannot escape it okay so what else for um, for april can my scorpio gang expect <laughs> see what comes after that see what comes after that reunion celebration parties joy feeling one with the, you know your loved ones and having a jolly good time so make sure make sure you don't uh, sweep things under the rug where your you know relationships are concerned clear the air it's going to lead you to the 10 of cups and the 3 of cups energy in april so spirit um, what should uh, what is uh, scorpio holding on to scorpio 5 of cups 5 uh, of pentacles this is a card of feeling left behind left out in the cold feeling in hermit mode feeling uh, i'm alone or nobody loves me uh, you're still holding on to some kind of past pain either you did that to somebody scorpio or somebody did that to you okay so and you're still holding on to the pain of that So what is this 5 of pentacles spirit which Scorpio is still holding on to Maybe there was arguments fights or some words which were exchanged which were not very pleasant So you could be holding on to a grudge If you are holding on to a grudge and feeling separated from somebody who's you know somebody who's dear to you uh, make sure you in april i think there is you going to be given an opportunity to talk and clear the air it's going to lead you to a lot of happiness scorpio so what should see the minute i say that i have a 4 for 4 on the clock this is again home stability 10 of cups <laughs> so beautiful okay so what spirit what uh, should scorpio let go of then to have a beautiful month of april Six of Pentacles. Why? Why should Scorpio let go of that? Three of Pentacles. Okay. And the ten. Okay. So now Spirit says, whatever um, unrest was created, whatever if you know relationships have been rocky or thing there's been conflict, this is going to be the time to end it. April is going to be the time. This is the end of that cycle. It's going to be closing out. This will be an opportunity now for you to work well with others, collaborate with the others, have partnerships, have equal give and take. Let go of this pain of the struggle or this unrest. So once you let go of that Scorpio is when 3 of pentacles jump straight to the 6 of pentacles. This is equal give and take having you know camaraderie what you give to me is what i give to you and then of course leads to emotional happiness of uh, the three of cups celebration joy and uh, you know that feeling of uh, balance in your life so spirit what can become scorpio's biggest blockage three of pentacles see the your blockage is This is like three people getting together and collaborating and working together to make something stable. So this is your blockage. Why is this a blockage, spirit? Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles a blockage or will become a blockage? Okay. Because that's what leads to you feeling unstable overall. Maybe this is with your finances or family life or. Um, you know just long term happiness uh, you will have to make that choice scorpio in uh, april i think this is uh, spirit's message to you the choice will be yours are you willing to start 
from scratch like wipe the slate clean and saying hey let's begin together and let's work it out that's the that's the one message i'm getting throughout my reading it's going to lead you to opening the gateway to a lot of happiness okay so if all goes well spirit and uh, scorpio well whatever the messages are takes them how will people be their close loved ones and you know the people who, who know scorpio very well how will they be seeing them in the month of april see now that after you uh, they going to see that hey you've done the work you've done your work you have uh, turned your back to anything anything that was unsettling and now people will be saying that your ships will start to come in in a big way like when a person is standing here that shows that somebody has done the necessary work to eliminate all the hardships in their life right so well that's how people are going to be seeing you why will people be seeing uh, scorpio in the three of wands energy spirit three of wands energy why will people my their loved ones be seeing them in the three of wands energy because you're finally out of the confusion getting out of the confusion this is a person who doesn't know what to do right they're very confused they don't know you know whether people are going to be treating them good or what should i do or which path should i follow or which cup should i take well your loved ones are going to be seeing you finally getting out of that confusion this is picking up that one cup and i feel that one cup will be the cup of love and camaraderie and that's when you will they will see that hey finally now well your ships are coming in to happiness joy long term stability and all that's that's good all right so spirit what's your secret message for scorpio for the month of april five of wands this is like having collaboration uh, having more hands on the deck that's that's the feeling i got immediately when i saw this card uh can i have something spirit what does it mean uh, what message is here for scorpio as your secret message why is the five of wands here okay one more oh yes 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 <laughs> taking back charge taking back control of your life scorpio and it's going to lead you to so much victory so much victory people have been waiting for you to maybe you know come forward okay uh, your i don't know who these people are or this person is but somebody has been waiting for for that green light from you and the minute you know this uh, imbalance which has come into your life is over well you'll see a lot of collaboration coming towards you a lot of people are going to be coming towards you and uh, putting you up on this horse for complete victory there's a lot of victory coming with the support of others many hands on the deck and that's what that's what's going to lead you to this feeling of victory and being celebrated applauded and uh, put you into this free spirited energy where you feel you have excitement for life once again that's what takes you straight to the 3 of cups celebration joy happiness So that's what I have for you Scorpio I hope it worked for you do let me know till next time then love and light take care namaste